Hey guys, morning everyone. It's Chris. Good Friday morning to be off from work. Of course, that's every morning to not have to go in. It's a good day. I just wanted to uh, come to you guys quick and um, topic I had uh, discussed briefly in my intro video, and that is aging aromatic tobacco. Aging, maybe not so much, is just uh, jarring, cellaring, storing. I, uh, the apartment I live in now, I uh, can't smoke inside, meaning winter is really not so much of a pipe season for me. Um, this was kind of a accidental experiment. I didn't really mean uh, to be storing it, aging it, again, whatever term you want to use for, uh, it's been in the jar for about a year. This is, um, it's a black Cavendish based, it's that one bada bing, uh, Kevin, you'll recognize it. Um, was able to store it over the past winter. Um, I don't know if that's something you guys have come across or whether it's really representative of what it's like to, um, to store an aromatic tobacco. Um, I've had some that haven't done well. Uh, I had uh, a couple like the uh, Golden Cavendish, if I'm even using that word correctly, uh, tobaccos that seem to really lose their flavor. Uh, not so much as sour as I've heard can happen, but it just didn't it didn't maintain the uh, the aromatic qualities, the scent, the flavor. Uh, it was it was all gone. This uh, about a bang cherry one um, definitely did maintain its flavor. I don't know if it mellowed out a bit. Um, Kevin really seems to like it. Uh, Louisiana pipe guy had sent him some. I uh, said it's one of the better cherries he's tried. So apparently he got a little hidden gem over in uh, Framingham, Massachusetts here. But uh, that's really it. Uh, I just wanted to uh, to drop by and share my thoughts on that. I don't know if, um, it, I know the guy deals a lot with the uh, Lane Limited as the base for a lot of his uh, brick and mortar blends. Uh, I don't know if it being a Black Cavendish or just BCA. Uh, I know uh, Jay Diggs, however you pronounce that uh, that last part of his uh, little made up internet name there. Um, I know he aged some BCA, said it went very well for him. Um, again, might have even mellowed a bit. Now that was uh, maybe longer than a year. But I don't know, maybe the black Cavendish is uh, is a secret. Maybe that's the one that uh, that lasts. Maybe the way maybe the way it's you know, cured, prepared, what have you, is uh, is the ticket. Maybe maybe that's the aromatic you can get away with. Don't know if you guys have had similar experiences. If you want to uh, leave your thoughts, let me know. I'm trying to think of a good joke for you. I got nothing. I'll have to try again. Talk to you later, guys.